So in part four of this tutorial, we are going to finish up this upper torso assembling. Resume from the last part, we just assemble the arms to it. One thing uh, I want to point out is there is a bug in our first version of the alpha alpha release that sometimes the, ind the index of TNT uh, links will get messed up uh, after you edit the model a lot. So if you see where the crash, you may want to try this. Uh, go to TNT base and uh, press this recompute link indices. Press yes. So what it does, it will clean up the uh, the corrupted indices in the link. So this is the bug uh, that's already fixed in our uh, internal build. Uh, in the next patch, we'll have that problem addressed. You most likely won't need to do this. But I'm creating the video with our last alpha release. So just a quick note. So now let's see if the arms work. Okay, so looks like the arm works. Let's just put the, the rest of the part quickly and the shoulder, you know, we can give it a hand. If I clone that, let's drag it here, make it look like a hand maybe. You can actually has a, you can actually have an elbow as well, but I won't bother create create that for now. So L hand. L hand parent will be L shoulder, R hand parent will be R shoulder. Okay, and just fix the fix the, the joint position. Okay, R hand. So the hand should be really light. Like that. Okay, just in case we recompute the indices. Let's see how it works. Uh, one thing is for shoulder and hands, you don't need that strong muscle strength. You just put a little bit uh, strength there, should be fine, like 10 1. Um, and also, we do have a slot under the limb configuration for hands. So now you have L hand, L, R hands into R. All right, seems to work. The last piece will build a head for this guy. Let's call this head. 
So the head's parent should be upper back. And the weight can be five. So we assign the head to, to the neck. So now we have every single uh, core limbs assigned under the limb configuration of TNT humanoid controller. We have a full-blown humanoid. You know, you can add a lot more parts than that. You can have more elbow, uh, more accessories part to the upper torso. Um, we'll talk about how to control them in separate uh, tutorials. But for now, it's almost complete. We just need to test to make sure the head works. Uh, okay, just make sure the intensity is correct. We'll do that. And uh, let's run. So, okay, looks like the humanoid is working. And uh, the last, let's have some fun with the control parameters. I showed you the height. You can crouching, you can standing up, crouching, standing up. You know, oops, I did too, 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 too much. It was falling down. Another thing you can do is that um, you can also control the, let's get it walking. Uh, you can also control the body leaning, right? You can leaning forward, leaning backward, leaning forward, leaning backward. You know, there are other things. You can leaning uh, sideways as well, doing the crazy things, you know. But if you do too much, it will, it will fall. So I think that's it. That's our uh, quick tutorial to build the robot from scratch, from uh, pure boxes. We'll see you next time. Thank you.